So, you're a beginner on YouTube and you wanna know how to make your videos better, right? Or you're here to dislike my video for no reason at all. Okay, so today I'm gonna be covering all the basics of editing and also give you some tips on them so you can make an awesome content. Okay, so you might be wondering which software is better to use. And the answer to that is Adobe Premiere Pro. Okay, first thing first, you need to have some recorded files, which I have here. You need to just drag and drop, drag and drop. Okay, after doing that, the first thing you will have to do is to spot the best moments for you that you like and then you have to cut them out. Okay, what we're gonna do now is now we're gonna find the spot where it all started. So it starts about here, as you can see. You can leave a marker just by pressing that or uh, pressing M on your keyboard. It's okay. Okay. Nice. Okay. And then that, okay. Okay, you can press again the uh, the mark. And now what you're gonna have to do is press C to open the scissor, and then find your marker and just go ahead and cut the footage that you want. What we can do now is now we can delete this footage here because we don't need it then I'm gonna cut my mistakes here like I don't need to show that to anyone so I'm gonna go like that I'm gonna zoom in in my timeline like this very easy okay so here I'm gonna zoom out a little so there is my fail, right? I didn't get the kill, so I'm gonna go ahead and click S to get the scissors. And then I'm gonna go ahead and cut out like here. Okay, so now we're gonna delete that also. Ripple delete, and then... Beautiful. Okay, so I miss click twice here. What I can do here is now like I can cut again. My two fails and then I can cut here and then delete this one and then do that again and then let's see. Okay, nice, nice, beautiful, I'm gonna go ahead and cut again, and then that's all what I'm gonna be using, so this here, right, I'm gonna do the same thing in the whole video now. So we're done now with the cutting, we can have a little watch, how it looks like, looks very nice, very smooth. Okay, let's move to the next 
پارت Now I'm gonna show you how to add subtitles just like this video right here. Hello, Wakanda, Wakanda. We do not respect hey. that for Wakanda people. You are very disrespectful. Take a picture. You are not good at disrespect the Wakanda people. Hey, it's the disrespect. Right. So what we can do here is now listen to what he says. Are you friends now? So he says. Are you friends now? And it sounds like from here. So I'm gonna go and press Ctrl T. Okay, I'm gonna make it a little smaller. I'm gonna type Are you friends now? I'm gonna move it, drag it here. Now I'm gonna go and change the uh, font to whatever font I like I like to have something sm simple all right let's just leave this for now, Are you friends now? okay Are you friends now? so I'm gonna go ahead and cut it here I don't need that Are you Are you friends now? okay Are you friends now? Are you friends now? So what I could have done differently is that I could I could do that. You need to hear like very very closely. Are you So he says, are you? Then he says, you? Here he says, friends. Friends. And then he says here now. So I can move them like that. Now. Wait, I messed up this one. Are you Are you friends now? friends now so yeah tip that you can use is just uh, select your uh, text add stroke then go to any color and then play with it just a little then do that again Then it should be looking like this. Are you friends now? Perfection. So, what is position and scale? It's basically these options here, which you can use to do this. Like, let me. So you can basically focus in this. Specific area. I'm gonna show you right now what I mean. So this here is what we need to like. We're not gonna change the position, but we're gonna change the scale. Yep, like that. And that's how it looks without it.
Now, you might be wondering what songs to use on your YouTube video. Are you scared of getting copyrighted? Then I have the easiest solution for you guys and it's the audio library. The audio library is provided by YouTube for us, the content creators. I personally use it so why wouldn't you? Bye guys, I think this is the end of this video, I hope you enjoyed it, if you would like to see more videos like this one then please let me know in the comments below and if you have any questions as well. Also if you thought the video was helpful then please hit like and consider subscribing and I will see you in the next one.